was in a wreck and he says that if it wasn't for blood donors, he wouldn't be alive today. Had 25 blood transfusions. He had seven in one night. Yeah, seven in one night. Philip Banks Sr. was in a major wreck while riding his motorcycle on Trans Mountain March of last year, suffering many injuries, including multiple broken bones. It was a fight for his life. I was bleeding out. Doctors didn't know exactly where. He says the people who donate blood helped save his life. Definitely could have bled to death. Right now, there's a critical shortage for blood. It usually means that we are days from running out of, of at least certain types. By talent says they are days away from running out. It doesn't just impact those who are involved in an emergency. What happens when you get a critical need and the, and the blood starts going low is elective surgeries or surgeries that people may need but that aren't emergent have to be postponed, you know, so because it has to be on the shelf for, for urgent need. During the summer, there's a bigger shortage, not only because people are busy traveling and doing summer activities, but because there are fewer blood drives held at schools. My talent gets about 30% of their donations from school drives. Philip's wife says she's thankful for those who saved her husband's life and says it's important for others to donate blood. Because you never know when you'll need blood. You never know when, you know, it very well may be you that need that blood, that need that transfusion.